Hello everyone, welcome or welcome back to my YouTube channel. I hope you guys are all doing really well. So today's video is a little bit of a different one, but I am very, very, very excited for this one as I'm actually gonna be doing a Junior Bake Off Q&A. So for those of you who don't already know, somehow last year I managed to end up on the Junior version of the Great British Bake Off and it was honestly, such an amazing experience and I am forever grateful to have been given the opportunity and I'm always receiving lots of different questions asking about my experience so I thought I would sit down and do a Q&A on it and I did ask you guys on my Instagram to give me some questions and I received lots of different questions so huge thank you to everyone who asked but I've handpicked the best ones and I'm looking forward to answering some of your questions. Okay, so the first question is, did you ever think you were gonna make it on the show? No, I never thought I would make it on the show. You just don't really think that it's something you'd ever do because obviously I watched the show, I watched the junior one um, when it was on CBBC and I definitely watched the adult one. I love it every year. Um, and it's just something that you don't really ever see yourself doing. So to have gotten on the show, it's just such a surreal feeling. Like you can't really describe it unless you sort of experienced it yourself, but I definitely didn't think I would get on the show when I applied. Okay, so the next question is, what was your favorite thing about Bake Off? Definitely a question I get asked all the time. My favorite thing about Bake Off was probably just meeting the people I met. I met so many amazing people and I've definitely made friends for life with the other contestants and the memories I've made are gonna stay with me forever. So, yeah. The next question is, what was your favorite showstopper? So my favorite showstopper was 100% my rainforest cake, which is actually there. Um, probably just because like I put so much work into it and a lot of thought definitely went into it. And I'm so happy it turned out well on the day. And it was kind of like my first ever showstopper I did in the tent. So yeah, it was just, it was definitely my favorite showstopper. Okay, so the next question is, how did you find out about the application form? And I love this question, by the way. So I found out about the application form on social media. One evening, I was literally just scrolling through my Instagram and then I saw like the little banner thing saying apply for Junior Bake Off. And at first, I was just like to my mum, oh, Junior Bake Off's returning. I didn't even think about applying. And then I was like to my mum, I could actually apply for this. Like I'm, you know, the right age that they're looking for. Um, so I then just thought about applying and I thought to myself, you know what, let's just go for it. And it went from there. The next question is, have you became a better baker since being on the show? The answer is 100% I have become a better baker. I feel like just from doing Junior Bake Off, I learned so much, especially from the other contestants. They're all so amazing. and very talented and I feel like you learn a lot from each other and I just feel like doing Junior Bake Off has just inspired me so much more and it's definitely made me have such a bigger passion for baking. The next question is do you wish you got further into the competition? Definitely I would have loved to get further I'm not gonna lie and um, I'm definitely gutted that I did unfortunately come up quite early um, unfortunately I went out on bread week for those of you guys who don't know which was week three Bread's just not my thing, I just don't do it. And a lot of you guys who know me know that I do do a lot of cakes. Um, so yeah, I just don't really do bread. So unfortunately it wasn't my week, but at the end of the day, I beat thousands of kids to get on the show and just getting on the show is such an achievement in itself. So I can't complain. So the next question, I actually love this question so much. Would you like to do baking as a career? So I'm not gonna lie, I don't really know what I want to do when I'm older, but baking is definitely up there, like what I would like to go into. Um, so I do like the idea of having my own bakery, like maybe like Slack Bakes or something as my own bakery. I just feel like that'd be pretty cool, like, you know, selling my cakes, things like that. However, I would like to be a TV chef. I'm not gonna lie to you, be like someone like Jamie Oliver or Gordon Ramsay, like, I just feel like that would be so cool, and I feel like because I'm so passionate about baking, I'd love sharing, like, recipes. A bit like what I do on my YouTube, but for, like, a TV chef, if that makes sense. Okay, so the next question is, did it feel weird watching it back on TV? Um, I don't think I really found it too weird, to be honest, watching it back on TV. I was just really excited, and for 
the first episode I was with my friends and we were literally just screaming every time we saw me. Like we were all just so excited. Um, it definitely brought back a lot of memories bringing it back. I was just like, oh, I want to be back in the tent. Um, but no, I just love watching it back to be honest. So many people ask me this question as well, but it's have you met up with any of the contestants since the show? Um, yeah, we all still keep in touch. I've met up with some of them after the show. It is definitely a bit hard though because we're not really near each other. Um, but we still keep in touch. They're like my favourite people and yeah. Next question, and I love this question so much. Um, would you do the adult bake off? I would definitely love to do the adult bake off, I'm not gonna lie. Junior bake off was amazing, but I feel like the great British bake off, like the adult bake off, I just feel like that would really challenge me, and I feel like that's something I'd love to do, and it's definitely something I would consider one day, but you just don't know what the future holds, to be honest, so we shall see. The next question is, how did people at school react? So, I definitely had a lot of mixed responses about Julia Bake Off. The majority was loads of lovely and supportive comments. Obviously, in life, there is gonna be a few people who aren't always happy for you, but that's life at the end of the day. And I did receive the odd negative comment from a few people, but I feel like as long as you're following your dreams and as long as you're happy, I think that's all that matters. And there's always going to be people in life who don't like to see you do well, so who cares about them? But overall, I had lots of lovely comments and people were very supportive. Do you have any regrets? No, I don't have any regrets. Um, I'm happy with how I came across. I'm happy with how it all went. Um, I just had a really good experience, so I don't have any regrets, no. The next question is, who was your favourite contestant from Junior Bake Off? I honestly can't choose, they were all amazing. Huge, huge shout out to all of them, they're absolute legends. The next question is, did you have a favourite week in JBO? My favourite week in Junior Bake Off was definitely the first week, and I feel like that's just because it was like the first time, like, um, I just met the other contestants, and obviously the judges, and I feel like the first week it was just so exciting, and we're in such a big bubble and the first thing was definitely amazing and there we have it we have came to the end of the video i hope you guys have all enjoyed watching and hopefully it's answered a few more of your questions if you've enjoyed this video don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to my channel so you won't miss any of my future videos but i'll see you all in my next video bye guys